welcome back uh, everyone um, so in this uh, video here we are going to touch up on the uh, on the tags and the um, tags types uh, data types uh, and so forth so as we saw in uh, the previous video uh, on the uh, these tags that were created automatically by the software itself uh, the user also has the ability to create their own uh, tags um, and specify their own uh, the, the data types uh, and so forth. So uh, we're just gonna stay with the basic uh, data types uh, for this uh, video uh, and to keep it uh, simple and. Uh, First tag I'm going to create here, just a boolean, I'm going to call it start command, and it's just going to be a boolean. But if we click on this one here, we can see this is the out of the box data types that the software uh, give us as options. So right now it's just going to be boolean and it's just one dimension. But you can go to three dimensions if you want. So it could be, uh, you could get uh, complex as well. Okay, so that's uh, will be that, and then uh, you can put uh, description. So you can call it pump start command, for example, and uh, stop command, and it's going to be. A boolean and uh, we're going to say pump stop command. We're also going to have um, start set points, uh, and this time I'm going to um, make it double integer. Starts set point, so we'll just keep it double integer. Stop set points again, double integer is fine. Stop set point, and I am also going to create a, uh, another tag. I'm just going to call it uh, level, so it's going to be some sort of uh, like tank level or something like that. Just an analog. In this, in this time, we're gonna make it a real float. So we can call it like a tank level, for instance. And I'm gonna create another tag. I'm gonna call it auto uh, manual. It's gonna be a bool. And in this uh, case here, I'm going to say zero equal to auto mode, for instance, and one is equal to manual mode, something like that. Okay, and in the same way, uh, we can keep creating the tags we need um, for our application. So that will be the, the first step. Or get into uh, writing your programs and, and so forth. Uh, for sure, this is uh, basically the basic basic way of adding uh, tags. And then to monitor your tags, you can go see here in this monitoring tag. You can see what's the values of your tags uh, in here. But also, there is some advanced uh, way and techniques to add your tags to your uh, program. I will just uh, touch up on some of them very, very quickly. So if you go to tools in here, there is a, a function that says import and export. So you can certainly import your tags and logic comments using uh, Excel. So you can put that in Excel and then you can you can import them uh, to your program. So that'll be probably uh, another video we can cover the, those topics once we get to uh, a more of intermediate, intermediate to uh, advanced level. Uh, in dealing with uh, logics 5000. 
So I hope you uh, enjoyed uh, the video and I'll see you in the uh, next one.